Hey everyone, my name is David Bowden with Spoken Gospel. We are a ministry dedicated to helping people see Jesus and his gospel on every page of the Bible. And today's verse is Proverbs 4.23, which says this, Above all else, guard your heart, for everything you do flows from it. Everything we do flows from our hearts. The heart, in the imagination of the Old Testament writers, was the center of the person. It is the collection of all their emotions and will and loves and hates. We often want to say that everything we do flows from our minds. You know, we believe we logically choose what is best and then decide to do it. But this is just not true. We don't ultimately do what we think. We do what we love. That is why the author of Proverbs wants us to guard our hearts. He wants us to guard what we love and what we cherish because ultimately that will lead to what we do. But the question should be asked, how do we guard our hearts? Well, just before this verse, the author of Proverbs is exhorting his son, to whom he's writing, to pay close attention to his words. Proverbs tells us to keep God's words in our heart, to love them and to cherish them. Because only when we love God's words will we do them. Jesus himself picks up on this teaching as well. He tells us that out of the overflow of our heart, the mouth speaks. What we love, we talk about. What we cherish, we act on. This is why we are constantly exhorted in the New Testament to love Jesus. Because he is the ultimate word of God that we love with our hearts and that overflows into everything we do. The best way to guard your heart then is to love Jesus. Then everything you do will flow from that love. But the best news of all is not that we love Jesus with our heart, but really that he first loved us with all of his heart. Out of the overflow of God's heartfelt love of us, Jesus laid down his life to save us. This is the word of the gospel. Keep it in your heart. Love Jesus in it. And everything you do will then flow from it.